You are listening to the news at this hour on Africa Business Radio. The federal government says that it would require about $2.3 trillion cumulatively or $150 billion annually to upgrade the poor state of Nigeria's infrastructure. Secretary to the government of the Federation, Mr. Boss Mustafa, noted that the private sector is expected to fund about 56% of this sum. He says even with dwindling resources, the federal government is committed to putting in in its own 44% to ensure that the nation's infrastructure stock, which he said the Mohammed Buhari administration met with 35%, is upgraded. Mustafa stated that this number was grossly inadequate for a country that was in dire need of inclusive growth and was far below the 70% international benchmark already attained by some emerging markets. He stated that in the light of limited resources worsened by the COVID-19 pandemic, the government needed to explore other financing options, which necessitated a greater focus on public-private partnerships. And that was the news at this time on Africa Business Radio. You can continue to listen live online at www.africabusinessradio.com or via our mobile app. I am Rachel Chijindu. Thank you for listening.